Minor earthquakes are not uncommon across parts of Western Canada, and provincial officials have confirmed that hydraulic fracturing, or fracking, has been the cause of numerous tremors. Scientists from the University of Waterloo have now mapped the areas in Alberta and British Columbia that are most likely to experience earthquakes induced by underground energy extraction. Those maps show that you know, which kind of fault in this um, area is a kind of uh, high likelihood to slip and that you know, it can, can easily produce earthquakes. So it's a good for a uh, company working in this field that, you know, okay, that region, if you uh, inject fluid, you probably will have an earthquake in this region and they try to be not in this area. Fracking is a process of injection of fluid, liquid material at the high pressure uh, to create a fracture in order to extract energy from deep underground resources. In addition to causing seismic activity, Fracking processes are energy intensive and in some instances have contaminated underground water sources with dangerous toxins. Numerous multi-million dollar settlements have been paid out in the U.S. as a result of fracking activity that led to contamination of private properties and sickness in the occupants. Some sustainable strategies also involve injecting fluids underground and have the potential to induce seismic activity. Any injection project like geothermal and CO2 sequestration is the same cost. You inject fluid, you change the stress in this area, you change the pore pressure from formation pressure. And the same process happens, but you know, the rate of the injection is different, the, the fluid is different, the viscosity is different. That, that, those will also affect on the size of The researchers conclude that the map and study findings can be used for planning future underground energy extraction projects and wastewater disposal which is essential knowledge as sustainable initiatives look to expand carbon sequestration and geothermal energy in Canada.